Gromit, I must stop eating cheese last thing. It's given me terrible dreams. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Uh, last night, I dreamt I'd accidentally become engaged to our neighbor, Miss Flit. Oh, oh, oh. Can you imagine? What's this? Oh, no, lad. So it wasn't a bad dream after all. It's a real life flipping nightmare. It's all coming back to me at the fair. I found that lug nut and she thought it was a... Oh, my kitty aunt. Talk about matrimonial misunderstandings. You've got to do something, Gromit. Uh, no. I've got to do something. I must go and speak to Miss Flit at once. I apologize and explain it was all a terrible mistake. I'm sure Miss Flit will understand. She'll probably be relieved when she learns I wasn't proposing marriage after all. It's not as if we've much in common. <laughs> well, I suppose there's nothing for it but to, uh... Ooh. Oh, Major Crumb. Yes? Ah, morning, Wallace. I've come about a professional matter of the utmost delicacy and secrecy. You have? Oh, wonderful. Uh, step into my consulting room and tell me all about it. Seems I'm going to be tied up for a while, Gromit. Uh, on business, uh, why don't you go and put your ear to the ground and find out how the land lies next door? Although we at Golden Retrieval believe the customer is always right, we may find it a little tricky to uh, uh, um, retrieve your lost item if you can't identify what it is. I didn't say I can't identify it. Uh, you didn't? No, that'd be idiotic. Do I look... I suppose we can start hunting for clues with my super clue snooper. Capital idea. I can identify. If there's any information gathering to be done, my eavesdropper is just the tool for it. Eavesdropper? I like the sound of it. It's not going to be an easy job. No, it isn't. It's going to be deuced difficult. That's why my colleagues and I are turning to you. We only work with the best. Oh, uh, uh, well, very kind of you to say so. But I won't stand for any monkey. Great Aunt Prue, 
sentence. You came so quickly. Of course, Felicity. An urgent summons from one's only living relative and heir to one's fortune can mean only one thing. Man trouble. Now, who is the blighter this time? I'll box his ears if he's been toying with your affections. Oh, no, no trouble as such, Aunt Prudence. But, well, there has been an important development on the matrimonial front, which... Pardon me, Aunt Prudence. I think I spy an ugly little intruder. I positively loathe fungi. Come, let's go inside for a cup of tea. Have you come, my old child? Man trouble always makes me hackles rise and my petticoats fluster. a little tinker yes um inventions and such like a handyman well you'll obviously have to put a stop to the inventing certainly not in the house can't be tolerated oh, oh no far too messy and intrusive well i think you've told me all i need to hear and so so long as he doesn't leave his contraptions lying around all over the house, he sounds a very suitable suitor. So our engagement has your blessing? I don't see why not. Unless... Yes? Unless, of course... Well, he's not... He's not a member of that... place, is he? That appalling country club whose name alone makes me shudder. You mean prickly thicket? Oh, yes. Oh, heavens, child, you know our family history. We flits have never associated with those dreadful prickly thicketers. Oh, you needn't worry, Aunt Prudence. Well, this isn't the prickly thicket type. Morning, Mr. Paneer. Constable Dibbins. Delivering the mail as well this morning? Aye. Posty's off sick. He's got the mumps and I've got the um. Sorry to hear that. Her Majesty's mail must be delivered. And PC Ernest Dibbins has never shrunk from duty. Even when such duties aren't even part of his blinking job description. Here's your post. Ah. Couldn't help but notice the coat of arms, Mr. Paneer. A prickly thicket, isn't it? Happen. So, you remember then? Hmm? Oh, aye, aye. Practically my second home. Is it now? That's a very interesting coincidence. I was just saying to myself the other day, Ernest Dibbins, it's time you joined a... Oh, my. Excuse me, Constable. What are you staring at? Get along now. Back off. Caught him trying to nick your letter. The important one from <coughs> Prickly Thicket. Oh, that's only the envelope. I've got the letter here. Not bad news, I trust. Oh, no. Quite the reverse. It's my turn to propose a new member. Is it really? Well, I never. It's a heavy responsibility. Not everyone's cut out to be a Prickly Thicketer. The candidate must be a gentleman of impeccable character. Someone who's always there for a friend in need. A pillar of the...